Okay, now we're on to the fleshing part of the mink. There's now there's actually really little to actually flesh on the mink. Uh, there'll be a little bit uh, below the arm and the armpit here, and then sometimes down at the base. Now this one is a, a female, uh, doesn't have a lot of fat on it, uh, and in, it's caught mid-November here. So if you catch them, if you catch them later in the year, they might not have any fat on really at all. You might not even have to flesh them at all. But uh, there's just a little bit underneath the armpit and some at the base here. So now what I've got just laid on top of my fleshing beam, it's not you know in over stretched over or anything. And I take my clamp, uh, you know, just a regular clamp that I use for all this, and I just put it on its head and drip it over the back so I can put my belly against it and doesn't pull over the top. But we're just going to take take the dull side of our fleshing knife and uh, scrape off. There's a little bit bigger chunk of meat and just a little bit of fat underneath it. That's all you got to take off. You don't need to scrape off any of this red saddle. Uh, that needs to be left on here. Now this bit of muscle... There's a bigger chunk from this of muscle on there. Uh, we'll take that off. And then we get down to the bottom here. There's just a real little bit. And be careful. Like I said, he's got thi very thin, very thin skin, much like a fox. So you just want to take her nice and slow and easy. Uh, it doesn't take a lot of pressure to skin a mink, or flesh a mink, I should say. Now that's clean already. Uh, you know, I just took a little bit off here and there. Now I'm just going to flip it over to the other side and do the same exact thing. We'll come, uh, I should say I got it laying, laying on its, or stretch, or laying here flat on its side. So the arm, the armhole is center uh, in the middle of it. I know it's kind of hard to, hard to see maybe, but uh, we'll just take our dull side, come underneath this arm and pull off that bigger chunk of membrane and a little bit of fat there. And then down here, as you saw in the skinning video, we had some of the stomach stomach membrane come along with it when we were fleshing or when we were skinning. So just take that off, and then a little bit down here at the bottom. Now you gotta look look real closely. If there's fat underneath the red membrane, that needs to come off. You gotta get that gotta get the fat off there at least. You don't need to take the red membrane off unless there's fat underneath it. So. Uh, this one, luckily, there's not much fat. We can leave most of that red membrane on there. And skin's real, or flesh is real fast. So we got it pretty well cleaned up here. Uh, just just check it. Roll it to where it's got its belly flat on here. Make sure the belly's clean. Nothing on there. Flip to where its back is on there. Uh, make sure the back is clean. Nothing on it. And so that that's how you skin, or flesh a mink. Uh, real easy, not much to it. Uh, if, and but there, you do have mink with, you will get mink with um, more, more fat on them. So you can take a nice look at this in the light here. You can see no fat on there. You can see the red membrane underneath the arm there where we stopped and took that down too and took the fat off there. But otherwise, very nice and clean. So next we'll move on to boarding.